Former NBA player Kwame Brown hits the nail in the head about Ja Morant's latest gun flashing on Instagram Live. Just watch. So Ja Morant, you like to play with guns, huh, boy? You like to play with guns, huh, boy? You like... You like to play with guns. So instead of you just being in your house buying all the guns you want, playing with all the guns you want off camera, you want to get in trouble for having a gun at a club, give a bullshit apology, and then show a gun on Instagram Live. I've heard of NBA young boy, but you NBA dumb boy. You got to be the dumbest motherfucker in the league. He's not wrong. John Morant is an NBA dumb boy. You got $231 million promised to you, and you want to be a fucking thug? Yeah, it's okay for you to have a gun. You have a, 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 in our, you have a right. You have a Second Amendment right to have a gun. But what the fuck do you keep pulling it out menacing for? What is up with all this music you keep listening to? Is this music putting you in a trance, dumbass boy? Because this music is about to cost you your fucking career. You're going to be bouncing around with niggas all day long just listening to music in the backyard of a goddamn shack if you keep on being a jackass. You was an NBA dumb boy. And your friends ain't your goddamn friend. Because I done done dumb shit before. And you know when I noticed a real friend? A real friend... They're going to tell you when you're wrong and then they ain't going to argue with you, but they just not going to participate and go with you in the bullshit. See, a real friend don't keep telling no man over and over and over what's right and what's wrong. You just tell them and you let them make their own decision. But you don't. I wouldn't be the friend in the car next with you recording you doing something stupid. That nigga that got that cell phone and knew you got a gun and know you dumb enough to pull it out on camera, he should have never been recording your dumb ass because you NBA dumb boy. His entourage doesn't give a shit about him. Thank God you can shoot a goddamn basketball you can jump because that's about all you can do. Your brain is fucked up because you got $231 million and you trying to be a street nigga? What kind of dumb ass shit is that? Them niggas don't think you no street nigga, dumb ass boy. Them niggas can't wait for your dumb ass to come to the chain game. They're going to see how high your ass jump. Your ass going to be playing ball at goddamn Pelican Bay, jumping over niggas in the chain game. They're going to knock your ass out there. They ain't going to let you just dunk on them like that in the chain game, you dumb motherfucker. You, you want to be the new Gilbert Arenas. You want to be the new motherfucking Gilbert Arenas. It's this fucked up ass culture where a black man just can't be a fucking black man. He got to be a dumb nigga that's pulling out guns and shit. Just because he listening to a goddamn song. Since when music and a gun go together, you dumb motherfucker? Why do you niggas always got to have a gun menacing in the air with a goddamn gun like that mean anything? It's all about who get that motherfucker out and downrange it on the target first. It don't matter you got a goddamn gun. Everybody got a motherfucking gun. Who you think you finna scare by showing somebody that little ass pistol? That ain't gonna scare no motherfucking body. So what the fuck are you doing? All you doing is making yourself look stupid. You are lowering yourself to the level of your motherfucking friends. And they not your friends. Because your friends should have looked at you with that goddamn gun in your hand, slapped that motherfucker out your hand, and fought you on camera. Because you know why? At least the white folks that paying you should say, you know what, at least he got somebody around him that care about him. That nigga should have been whipping your ass with that gun on camera so them white folks cannot void your goddamn contract. Because he eating off your dumb ass. And you going to sink the whole ship because you want to be a street nigga. And them white folks not going to leave you with that type of money. You trying to be a street nigga. So your daddy can smile at every game all he want to. But the moment them white folks see that goddamn picture, boy, you finna lose a shit ton of money. I'm, I'm done talking to your dumb man. You just dumb. You just a nigga that can jump. You a straight up nigga. That's the problem. That is the problem. Somebody need to tell it to you just like this. You a dumb, stupid nigga. So if that's, what the, if that's the point that you wanted to get across, that you a dumb, stupid nigga, I believe you. All this goddamn money these white folks giving out $231 million and you niggas just trying to get it back. You niggas just, I don't want the $231 million white man. Fuck you giving me all this money for? Get some of this shit back.
Just stupid for no goddamn reason. This rant by Kwame Brown is what Jamaran's parents should be hammering into Jamaran's head. It is what it is.